Good morning, San Jose Middle School Scorpions. Today is Wednesday, June 2nd, and I'm calling to tell you that the band is back. Yes, that was the scene last night at our outdoor band concert. So congratulations to the band and to Ms. D for bringing music back to San Jose Middle School. Oh, stop, band. Uh, students, it's Pride Month. June is Pride Month, and this is the Progress Pride flag, recognizing LGBTQ plus communities, including marginalized communities of color. So we'll be talking more about Pride Month as we go through the month. Let's continue now with our eighth grade department awards. Here, we'll begin with AVID. Hi everybody, Ms. Cosentino here. This year's AVID award is gonna be going to Adrian Garcia Benitez. Um, Adrian has been in the AVID program since he was a sixth grader. He has done so well every single year. Um, he challenges himself. He <clears throat> puts his focus towards his career, possible careers and different college options. And I am so proud of the person that you have become, not only in my class, but on campus. Um, your passion for social justice reform and the passion that you have for your own future um, is contagious. I am so proud of you. I cannot wait to see all of the great things that you accomplish in this world. Take care. Hi, everybody. Miss Cos. And here is physical education. Dom Scafani, congratulations. You are one of the recipients of the Physical Education Department Awards. We look to honor a student who embodies hard work, kindness, and a collaborative nature. I remember as a sixth grader when you arrived, you didn't so much arrive as you were shot out of a cannon. <laughs> you were less concerned with what was required and more concerned with what you were capable of achieving. And this has continued throughout your seventh and eighth grade years here at San Jose Middle School. Your kindness is evident in your interactions with your classmates. You are upbeat, you are good natured. It also is evident in your collaboration with your classmates. You enjoy performing at a high level, but you see the merits of getting your teammates and classmates involved in the daily activities. We were so greedy to get to like be able to honor you with this award, and we were so fortunate to be able to do that. And we're just so fortunate that we had you here for three years at San Jose Middle School. So congratulations and best of luck in your next endeavors. Thanks, Dom. Dom Scaf What does Mr. Nottingham have to say? Hi, Mr. Nottingham here, and I am uh, excited and proud to announce that one of our Department Award winners is Sitlali Carlos Lozano. So Sitlali is just a joy to have in PE class. Uh, she puts forth tremendous effort. She participates to her fullest. She always shows great sportsmanship. And then you combine that with her just natural abilities. She's very athletic. Uh, she can step onto any field or any court and play any and all sports and activities at a, at a really high level. So she is just the epitome of what a fantastic PE student is. Effort, participation, sportsmanship, combined with her natural gifts. Uh, I know she'll be successful in everything she does, and I can't wait to see what she does in high school. Congratulations, Sit Lolly. Ah, music. Cool. Hi, I'm Miss Steve, and I'm the band teacher at San Jose. And I would like to give this eighth grade award for music to this fine musician, Diego Seligman Topper. He's a fine, fine pianist, and it's been just amazing having him in our group. 
Congratulations. Yeah. Ah, Ms. Cosentino. Hi, everybody. Ms. Cosentino here. Um, this year's science award is going to be going to Olivia Zidane. She has really, really excelled this school year with all of the challenges that we've all faced. Um, Olivia, at the beginning of the year, made it known that her focus this year is to get into the medical career pathway program at Novato High School. And she buckled down. She got her work done. She asked questions. She asked for help along the way. Um, and her perseverance brought her to where she is today. I am so proud of you for getting into medical careers pathways at Novato High School. I look forward to all of the great things I know you're going to accomplish. And maybe one day you'll be our doctor. Hello, San Jose. Um, this is Mr. Leach, and I'm here today to announce one of the 8th grade science awards. Um, I cannot remember a year uh, where there were so many uh, deserving students. Um, I know that this was a very challenging year for everybody involved. Um, when I started to look at 8th uh, graders and who were deserving, I realized it was a really long list. Um, having said that, though, I would like to um, acknowledge um, that one of the 8th grade winners today will be Brielle Donner. Um, Brielle uh, did terrific work. She was an exemplary student under very difficult circumstances. Um, during Zoom, uh, her uh, participation and uh, willingness to get involved with the lesson um, was noticeable and she did a great job. Uh, once we returned to in person, uh, the quality of work that she was producing was second to none. Um, and in fact, during the second semester, she had a perfect grade, 100%, um, which was the only uh, student that I have that can say that. Um, Rail also uh, displays uh, terrific leadership skills. Uh, she's very kind to all of her classmates. Um, and I would like to congratulate Brielle on winning one of the 8th grade science awards. Thank you. Wow, Scorpions, we are so proud of you and all of the work that you have done this year. Uh, we are remembering that it's Scorpion Future Focused Week. We are focused on our future by participating in some fun um, uh, activities. So here we are. Today is Wednesday. I hope you are wearing your sports and college gear today. And uh, let's see, here we are doing all that. We're building our community by participating. And uh, tomorrow you're going to be wearing tropical wear, tropical wear in tropical colors. So make sure you do that. Hey, we're gonna hear about Mr. Ermini's college experience. This is the AVID um, project of doing a little bit of research about people's college pathways. Uh, Mr. Ermini went to the University of California at Davis in Davis, California. Um, he is not going to, he does not plan to go for any further higher education, but he has a major in the Bachelor of Arts and his highest degree is a JD degree, a law degree. He went to UC Davis for four years and went to Golden Gate University for three years and then on to Dominican University for one year to get a teaching credential. The mascot of UC Davis is the UC Davis Aggies. He played there on the varsity water polo team and the school colors for UC Davis are blue and gold. Just a reminder that June 10th, next Thursday, is a remote day for all students, and we will be celebrating promotion beginning at 1 p.m. Uh, it is Wednesday. Remember, it's Wednesday. Sometimes it feels like Tuesday, but it's Wednesday, so we'll start with period five today, and we'll be done at 12.05. You have 40 minutes of asynchronous to work to do when you get home, and then we will be done. So students, thanks so much for your attention to these announcements as we celebrate our Scorpion family, and remember, make it a great day. <laughs>